the sound of clock ticking could be heard in the quiet living room along with the heavy breathing of a woman who was pacing back and forth her hands were clenched as she fumed in anger the scowl on her face was clearly visible by the look on her face anyone could tell that someone was in a big trouble let him come home today she pulled the sleeves of her sweater up to her elbows as she greeted out the words to herself she glanced at the wall clock and flared her nose in anger half past 1 jimin you have awakened a monster in me i'll not spare you today few moments later she heard the sound of jiggling of keys and the front door opened revealing her husband who was looking exhausted for a minute second her gaze softened but soon the scowl look took over he tiredly smiled at her as soon as he acknowledged her presence baby why are you still awake you should have slept it's quite late she gave him a tight lip sarcastic smile i was waiting for you that's so sweet of you but as i said you don't have to trouble yourself have you had dinner Yeah, have you? He asked, taking a seat on the couch. Yes. We need to talk. Can we talk tomorrow? I'm tired. Same here. I am tired too. Tired of you, your attitude and your work. He sighed tiredly. Not now, Van. It's now or never. I need to give you a peace of mind. Have you seen the time? It's freaking 2 at night. Is this the time to come home? Baby, I was wo- no, not again with your. I was working. There's limit of everything. Two weeks. You have been doing this since two weeks. Do you know how worried I am for you? I know, Ian, but work is important. Is it more important than your health? No, right? I have been craving to spend some time with you, but you are always busy with your work. I also work, but I still manage time for you. Wine was at the edge due to her anger. So was Jemin due to tiredness. He sighed. I can't ignore my work, but you can ignore me. You know what? Just marry your work. She removed her wedding ring and threw it on the couch, earning a glare for Jemin. What kind of behavior is this, Wine? He said, picking up the ring and stood up facing her. Wear it. He slided the ring back on her ring finger, but she again removed it. Wan, don't test my patience. What will you do? He glanced at Joe and again slided the ring in her finger, but Wan, being stubborn, again removed it. Wan, don't be stubborn and wear it. No, I won't until you promise to take me on a vacation. He sighed and nodded. We will go after two months. Now wear the ring. No, I want to go this week. We can't, Juan. I have work, 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 work. I'm sick of hearing this. And look at yourself. Work is aging you more rapidly. You are not even thirty, but you still look like sixty. And you even have grey hair. His eyes widened as he ran to the mirror hanging there. He looked at his reflection and held his head. God, woman, I have grey hair because I dyed them grey. Whatever, but still you have grey hair and you look old and you walk like a zombie after working like a robot whole day. This isn't called living a life. This is called surviving. I walk like a zombie. Of course, you walk like this. She stood up and did a weird walk. Jimin bit back a smile. and then you slump on the couch and sigh like an old man jimin sighed hearing her words see you did it just now he chuckled this isn't funny we are having a serious argument over here he smiled and nodded his head you need a break and we are definitely going on a vacation see your face it scream tiredness you need rest I know, but my wife isn't letting me rest. 
you need a long vacation to rest why don't i don't understand no 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 she shook her head like a child and sat down on the floor in the middle of the living room i am done i am done with this conversation i am done with you i am done with your work i am done being your wife i am done being understanding i am done with everything in fact i am done being a human it would be better if i were a monkey living on trees and eating fruits no worries of life and no worries of husband just me trees and banana Jamie broke out in loud burst of laughter earning a glare from Wayne I just imagine you as a monkey he said in between his laugh Wayne extended her hand to grab a pillow before throwing it on his face stop laughing he bit his lip to control his laughter he stepped forward and sat in front of her on the floor what does my beautiful wife want either take me on a vacation or give me a divorce now where did this divorce came from ye yeah. divorce me so that i can find a new husband for me who will give me time and will me will take me out somewhere she puffed her cheeks and looked away he sighed and cupped her face between his hands when work is a trend I want to give you a bright future. But what about the present? Huh? You will give me a bright future. I agree. But what about the present that you are missing out? You know that this time will not come back. I don't want the luxurious life for which you have to exhaust yourself this much. She gently traced his face with her fingers. I'd rather be happy with only one time meal per day if you will with me what will I do with that future where we will be together but still far away Jimin was attentively listening to her with a smile gracing his lips what is more important to you your wife or your work of course my wife then ditch the work and go out with me somewhere you really need to focus on yourself I never knew my wife is mature to. Wan glared at him. What do you mean? I am mature. Yeah, you are. He packed her cheek and picked her up in bridal style. Wan wrapped her arms around his neck as a reflex. What are you doing? I made you worried, so I am making up to you. He smiled, taking her towards the bedroom. He gently lay her down on the bed and unbuttoned his shirt before throwing it somewhere in the room. He lay down beside her and wrapped his arms around her and closed his eyes. Wayne smiled up and she looked at him. What are you doing? He opened his eyes and looked at her. Cuddling you? This is your make it up to you mean? Yeah. Wan sat up and blinked her eyes at him. Talking sweetly with me, then picking me in your arm, giving me a seductive look, taking me here, exciting me, then lay, lying me down on our bed, removing your shirt to show your Greek god body, making me feel things was all for just cuddling. Yeah. Wan gritted her teeth. and spanked him he gasped and looked at her perplexed what was that for get lost from here i really want a new husband now just get lost sleep on the couch outside but what did i do now this is the problem you don't do anything she held her head god what since i committed to have a husband like him Jimin was looking at her innocently. Are you pregnant, Wan? Because you are behaving like one. Are you important, Jimin? Because I think you are. His jaw dropped, and he gave an offended look. Do you really think like this? 
we have consumed up teen time do you still have doubts then definitely you are getting old you are losing your stamina he placed his hand on his chest above his heart making his heart freeze you really hurt my ego this time why smoked at him oh i did what will you do he turned to other side and closed his eyes wiping that smirk off her face what are you doing now thinking what will i do wine groaned and again smacked him he turned towards her now what you were supposed to pin me on the bed and whispered in deep voice let me show you my stamina and then do the deeds what deeds oh god jimin are you really that stupid or you are someone else because my husband is very quick and cunning when it comes to these things he pinned her on the bed pressing her back on the mattress and hovered over her do you want me he smiled cheerily why rolled her eyes not anymore you ruined my mood now get off me and let me sleep old man one tried to push him but he held her wrist and smoked not so easily don't you think you deserve a punishment from throwing a wedding ring and calling me old and important he said sliding the ring on her finger while smoked and flipped the position pinning him under her she sat on his stomach and leaned towards his face then you deserve the biggest punishment for not spending time with me and ignoring your health when i she placed her index finger on his lips sussing him not a word don't waste your energy you need a load because you are the one who is going to scream my name tonight jimin gulped and while being the woman of her words did as she said she never backed off from her commitments then how can she this time she made him scream and how that's german and wine to know and you to ignore